in this video we are going to learn about the GA4 free from exploration report so actually in GA4 you can get two types of report one is normal report where you can get access to predefined matrices diamonds if you want to do deeper analysis you need to create exploration report okay so here you can get a uh, normal report and exploration report hi guys i'm smruti from solutions 8 and in this video we are going to learn about the ga4 free from exploration report okay so actually in ga4 you can get two types of report one is normal report where you can get access to predefined matrices dimensions etc you can use that report to quick analysis to normal analysis but if you want to do deeper analysis you need to create exploration report okay so here you can get a normal report and exploration report just click here then here analytics will provide several types of exploration report one is free from exploration report which we are going to discuss about today uh, another is uh, formula uh, funnel exploration path exploration segment overlap cohort exploration uh, user lifetime so these are the templates uh, provided by ga4 you can use these templates to analysis quickly but in this video we are going to learn how you can create a free from exploration report from scratch okay to create any kind of any type of exploration report you need to click here then you will get a dashboard okay so first of all you will get this huge panel where the data will show this panel called tab okay inside a single exploration report you can add multiple tabs okay just click here and choose your uh, exploration report type and you can create another tab okay so let's delete this so this is one panel and another two panels are variables and tab settings okay so in variables you need to add segments dimensions and matrices to use throughout the report throughout the exploration report but to use inside a single tab you need to add these things to uh, the tab settings okay so let's add dimensions and matrices and we'll talk about segments later just click on the plus icon and you, you will get access to several types of dimensions just choose your dimensions from the drop down like this yeah even you can use this search box to search your dimensions i'm going to add country then city city then i'm going to add device device okay click here import then it will add here then we need to add matrices uh, uh, this time I'm going to search for session session and another age purchase then import okay so as i said after adding the variables you need to add these variables dimensions and matrices to the tab setting to use inside a single tab okay so let's add country first so dimension you can add uh, in rows and columns okay 
so if you drag and drop row and column area will highlight so drag and drop inside row okay and for quick uh, use quick navigation you can double click it will add here okay and the matrices will go to values area and here even you can use double click okay so here you can see the data uh, from united states new york you have this this much of session and purchases and uh, so on so uh, in this way you can use uh, exploration report so here uh, as you can see uh, the countries are repeating because inside one country there are multiple cities okay so actually to analyze this way is getting messy but we can make it visually clear by using um, this option nested rows just enable it and it will make it clear okay so it will segment out properly inside the united states these are the countries and these are the sessions and purchases inside uh, india these are the cities and session and purchases and so on okay and uh, you can change the date range even so here is the date range you can select from this yeah you can select your custom date range from here and even you can use this compare feature to compare the data okay and here another thing is uh, uh, rows uh, and uh, sorry uh, rows uh, number of rows and uh, starting rows okay so uh, it it will show up to 10th row like you can see up to 10th row okay but if you want to see more you can increase it to 500 okay and uh, here uh, start row is one from one one row it will start but if you want to start from 10th it will start from the 10th row okay so you can use these settings too so as i said uh, dimensions you can add in both uh, rows and column let's add these dimensions to column okay so you can even analyze deeper by segment it out further so it says uh, uh, this is the country and city and uh, device this is not said by the way and these are the device and inside of each device these are the session and purchases so you can check the data um, by segmented out device country city at a time okay then uh, here is one thing uh, you can even use a filter option to filter uh, dimension and matrices let's suppose i want to see only united states data you can click here and choose country and uh, here select the type contains and i'm going to united states apply so in this way you can see only united states data okay this is not a glitch i'm interrupting the video you're watching because i need to remind you that i'm always looking for people to join our team so if you're passionate about google ads and you want to work with the best google ads agency on the planet please go to solate.com forward slash apply speaking of working with the best google ads agency on the planet if you're having trouble with google ads and you want professional help that's what we do you can go to solate.com that's s-o-l-8.com to apply for your free no obligation action plan and if i've given you any level of value at all maybe think about giving me a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel that's how we juice the youtube algorithm so they actually know that i know what i'm talking about if you have questions comments concerns or confessions hit me below in the comments and now back to your regularly scheduled program 
then we'll talk about segments let me clear the column to make it clear more and uh, cd okay so segments you can create segments uh, and uh, you can compare the segments segments means you can create like so it's like an audience you can create uh, like uh, if uh, i want to compare the uh, traffic between organic and paid i can create two segments for uh, paid and organic and i can compare it okay so click here to create a segment uh, so here you can create a suggested segment you can create from here but we will create a custom segment so as we are uh, analyzing session so we should uh, use session segment okay so from here you need to find out the uh, traffic source okay so from this dimensions you can directly choose yeah even here you can use the search box so i'm going to use medium search for medium okay so here is traffic source session medium and i'm going to filter out uh, cpc okay so cpc medium is will uh, uh will show the um, pair traffic okay just apply and even you can see the su summary of the traffic the session belongs to this segment okay so here it's and just name it then click here save and apply so here pair traffic has been added and we need to create another segment to compare and i'm going to search for again medium session medium and i'm going to filter organic so here it's organic just apply and name it organic traffic and save and apply okay so here is the segment organic paid and total okay so you can compare the total traffic versus organic traffic versus paid traffic okay inside of single uh, segment you can see session and purchase like column one so here is also same okay so in this way you can use the segment feature to you can create segment and uh, compare the segment in good team okay so just um, uh, create your exploration report and play with the several types of segments uh, dimensions and matrices and use those and see the data how these things are working we will learn better okay so in this way you can create and you can learn uh, how to create free from exploration report so that's it for today and if you like this video please thumbs up and share this video with your friend family wherever you can and make sure to subscribe to this channel to watch this kind of valuable tutorial ahead okay so thank you for watching and see you again bye bye Hi guys, I'm Smriti from Solutions 8 and in this video we are going to learn how you can use GA4 acquisition report. Okay, so basically by using acquisition report you can know about your website traffic. Okay.